Hello everyone, and welcome to a video here for Pez 6. So, um, I wanted to do just a quick little video that I can make really quickly and put out, and just kind of demonstrate kind of what football looks like, uh, virtual football looked like in 2006 when this came out for the 06 07 season. So, this is modded. Um, I'll put a link in the description to the mods. The, there is a patch slash mod for this and I'm playing this on the PC so it will look very different than the PS2 or any other versions that may have played but basically what this uh, patch does is that it provides all the correct licensing and a lot of the major stadiums are in the game as well um, obviously Sheffield is a play in Highbury but Excuse me, the major, major stadiums are in the game. You see Bundesliga here as well, which I don't believe was in the original PES 6 or PES 2007. Um, I think the US version is PES 2007 or 2011, 2007, which is what I have on my PS2. And then we have Syria. Obviously, um, if you know about football and soccer at this time, the scandal with Juventus occurred so they were relegated for this season if I do believe so they're in C or was it A? Yeah A so they're right there and then Liga Espanol La Liga right here yeah so I just wanted to play a quick game and talk while I'm doing the game and talk about um, this mod and what it has to offer as well as possibly doing a showcase of it in the future, um, like a formal so showcase of it all. But it's not too difficult to download, so the video I'm going to put in the description will provide a link in their description of that video of how to download it, and it's very simple to download. But we'll do uh, my favorite European teams, we'll do Man United versus, uh, let's do Barcelona. So we'll do that, and as you can see, it has kits in the original PES 6 on the PS2 um, and the PC. I, I do believe they didn't have the, maybe for Man United they had the kits, but um, they didn't have it to be so distinct looking. But we'll play in United's white, and our second play in their regular Logana. And we'll do that. We'll have the interesting to showcase that. And we'll just play with the normal lineup. So yeah, so this game's option file is also also unique in the fact that it has all the correct potentials for the players. So for instance, Messi has probably about a 99 potential overall rating. Um, players like... Uh, players that were really young at the time, I think, like, PK have a really good overall rating. Um, so yeah, so those type of things where they have a good potential, it showcases what the potential of their actual career was. And then, if you didn't play these games and you were coming from a newer audience, so has 21 or eFootball or even... The newer FIFAs, this will look very dated, um, but it's still really fun. I enjoy it, and the game is very is so old at this time that they didn't have 360 movement. It's still 45 degree movement, so in a weird way, it actually makes it. <laughs> this sounds like someone who's just very biased, but it makes it kind of more fun because um, you don't have. Um, the variety it, it makes it very simple so it makes it a very simple game it makes it difficult to score goals so if you score amazing goals they look so cool um, in this game hopefully I'll be able to score at least one to showcase that oh temp there but yeah this was a very interesting year um, in football because it was the year before United had gone to the Champions League final pinnacle of their time uh, with Ronaldo and, and the team with the 08 Champions League final um, still in their dominance Chelsea 
I believe still had Mourinho at the time. And then this was, I believe, the year before, or maybe the year of um, Pep Guardiola coming to, going to Barcelona as well as a manager. See, schools. But obviously, as you can see, all of the rosters are perfect to what they were in 2007 season. So United have Paul Scholes, Ryan Giggs, Gary Neville, Michael Carrick, Wayne Rooney, uh, Edwin Van de Sar, Rio Ferdinand, Vidic, Patrice Evra, like the en that entire team. So it's, it's really interesting and fun for me who didn't get to experience playing these games and experience watching football at that time. I didn't, I think I've said a couple times in a few of my videos how I didn't actually get into knowing about European football and soccer until I was about 15 or 14. So it's, it's fun playing these games and see what I didn't get to experience and experiencing it now. Just gotta focus. Ooh, good goal by them. I think Deco, Deco scored that. Yeah, as you can see, Deco is still there at that time. I think within the next season he would be gone. Him and Edo, and he transitioned to Messi being the fulcrum, that sort of thing. But yeah, Ronaldinho is still there too, so it's a really good Barca team. But yeah, um, in this mod. It has all the correct licensing for all the teams. There's other mods too for Pez 6 that I would love to be able to showcase eventually. Um, and re the, really the main reason I like to showcase all this is just the history of it all. It can be really important. And even playing this game I could make videos about the history of the teams and um, what they would do virtually in the game as well. So. Just ideas. But yeah, for PES 6, for the PC version, is very large base of patches and mods. So they have modding for, I think, all the major World Cups. They have a mod for all the... Let's see if I can... It's not going to outpace him. But... Oh, wait, he did. Ernie... Oof. Good attempt. But... With this, um, a majority of the mods in PES 6 provide um, different content in different eras, so it makes it fun being a kind of a football buff like I am to learn and see the tactics they're using and see the teams. Uh, they have the World Cup one, like I said. They have the Champions League one, which at least I know provides all of the Champions League finals ever played, I believe, or at least from the 1990 season, from when, from that era. And then they also have um, a mod for the current season. So, a lot of opportunities and a lot of content to be able to experience. But this one, again, was created in order um, to have everything kind of complete for this and still provide the feeling and aesthetic of Pez 6. And it's, it doesn't, I'm biased because I play older games so I don't get bothered by it, but I don't think it looks too bad. And graphically, with the PC version, it's a lot crisper than even the uh, PS2 version. It is difficult. It's a learning curve going back to these games that are very different in how they play. Like I had, a, I pressed up on the the uh, joystick to play that pass, even though it, it technically you just play it right to them in the um, newer newer pezes. There's a lot more rotation of axis and that sort of thing. Whereas this one's 45 degree angle. Then you see Messi right there with number 18. So, it's a distinct era, because it is 16 years ago, so it, I 
would love to be able to continue the Pez 07 career mode that I was doing, um, or Master League that I was doing, onto this, so I might be doing that eventually. And again, if you guys like this, looking at back on these, I could always do team dissections and just dissecting kind of the history of teams and how they did that season um, through showing the gameplay of Pez. Oh, I should have pulled them back in more. Okay. And then this United team had Henrik Larsson. Um, Ole Gunnar Solskjaer was still there. So, it was a very key year for them. Let's see if we can try to score a goal and at least get this to PKs. This is on top player, or professional. Top player back then was the highest difficulty. So it's one below the highest. Okay. It's difficult because also United's still in their classic 4-4-2 formation. So... Edo is so fast. Um, damn it. I, I see like there. Oh my. Okay. There we go. Come on, come on. Wide. There I was trying to... There I was trying to play forward, but... It's got to be more obtuse with your passing. And they had Ch Iniesta with hair. <laughs> Jesus, they're pressing. Yep. Okay, okay. Calm down, calm down. That's, it's very hard to break them down. And I was going to say, that they're in their 4 3, 3 formation, I'm pretty sure, too. So it makes it very difficult to have to find space. Yeah, it looks like they're in a 4 3 3 type. Okay. Go, 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 Louisa. Damn it. Get to it, Zaha. Get to it. And then there, I'm still trying to learn that chipping actually is a viable option. <laughs> but, but yeah, so a lot of history available to it and um, it'd be interesting to see if I it I, I would love to be able to put a master league through till now but I'd have to play through with it through it um, more than likely okay let's go ahead and kick it forward let's get it to Zaha oh that would have been it Go, go Skulls. Go Skullsy. Oh! We're getting good opportunities, we just can't get them to be shots and target. Come on. Go. Go Ronaldo. Go. just be losing this one now which is <laughs> understandable um they pull you all there chavi is now their manager iniesta offsides okay um Let's take Ronaldo off. Let's put G Sun Park on. Let's take Zaha off and put on Ali Gunnar Solskjaer. And then 
Let's take Carrick off and put on Richardson. That's a foul. Emilson. They also, with the mod, they upgraded their... They patched all the faces so they looked more realistic. This is pretty far out, but we can... Let's, let's just try. Let's just see it. Let's have a go. On target. Ambitious, but on target. Oh, come on, come on. Oh, zero. zero. Yeah, that looks like it's it. That's it. Top quality, close control. Clear. Yep, that's it. One nil loss. Hey, not bad um, for the second highest difficulty. I actually had tried recording this earlier um, and did it with United versus Real Madrid. I was able to win that 3 nil, but um, Barca definitely was top their game back then. Um, to be fair, it's kind of funny to think, but at this time, before, this may have been the year Guardiola came in, or right before Guardiola came in, they were kind of in a downward trajectory, and then, obviously, from, I think, 08 to 12 was some of their best seasons ever. But yeah, just a quick little video to share with you guys what virtual football looked back in 2006, <laughs> or what we thought it may have looked like. But thank you guys for watching, and I hope I'll be back soon with another My Player video or one of these. So, see ya!